There's a lot of young guns coming up in 2018. So rookie of the split is the first prediction we're looking at here. And, um, you know, for me, there's basically two guys that it's coming down to. And that's going to be mini true packs and upset on Shulka and Vitality. Um, there are a lot of other guys like Sheriff and Kedril, but I think these two AD carries are the guys to be looking out for in 2018. You look at these numbers in the 2018 promotion tournament, number one and two in the entire tournament. Doesn't uh, get better than that. That's pretty good. <laughs> that's pretty good. And they're obviously the featured carries on their squad. Maybe not so much now for upset on Shulka, but uh, these are the main two guys I'm thinking. Right. And I think that when you look at these two guys, for me, my guy who I think will be the rookie of the split in Europe, it's got to be Mini Trupax. He is easily, in my eyes, the best Portuguese AD carry to ever come out. And I think that he is somebody with the guidance of Yamato Cannon on Vitality, is someone who will come into the scene and not have the early struggles that we've seen from rookie players uh, usually. And I think that this is a guy, he's going to come right in and have an impact strong for Vitality out of the gates. Yeah, and that makes sense, especially when he's got four or three teammates that he had on Giants. But I got to lean towards upset for Ricky the split. Um, he, he's kind of, he's in a similar scenario to when Zven or Niels came into the scene with Origin, where he's surrounded with veteran talent in guys like Vizichachi, Vander in the bottom lane, who he's played with before, by the way. Uh, and also a guy like Nuketuck in the mid lane. So I don't think there's going to be as huge a pressure on upset and he's going to be able to really be one of the main carries if not the main carry on the squad and with so much so many guys helping him out i think you're going to see really how much talent this guy has he's been dominating solo queue uh he already has again a bit of synergy with vander because they did play together before and i think he's just pretty much in the dream setup he's the only remaining guy from that shulka lineup that played in the promotion tournament and he was the standout player on that squad so I think he's got a really good opportunity to carry a lot of these games and he's in a perfect position to take home some hardware this year right and I think if, and again if you are gonna look at any other rookie other than mini true pack I think you do have to look at upset he's probably the only other guy that I would think would really qualify for being you know someone you would put up for that rookie of the split award right away uh, you know, when you're looking at Crepo as well, helping him on the coaching staff for Schalke is something that I think can't be underrated. Even when you're talking about the help that he will get from his veteran teammates, I think talking about Crepo as a coach there is something that could help him uh, beat my guy out for that uh, rookie to split. Yeah, and going back to Mini, I mean, if you're going back to the promotion tournament, people would say, oh, you know, he outperformed uh, upset in that tournament you saw some pretty, pretty slim margins yeah you but. saw those very similar numbers but if you actually look into the games and the head-to-head -head, uh mini probably did have the better performance performances in those head-to-heads but i mean you look at their lcs rosters and upsets on a totally different team uh mini three of the five guys have zero lcs experience on vitality you're just looking at gilius and cabo shard and cabo shard eh, he hasn't been that great really the last year on Vitality, uh, he's, he wasn't that carry threat that we're used to seeing. So there's going to be a little bit more pressure on Mini Trupax to carry on his team than there is on Upset. And I think uh, Upset takes it. Well, I think whoever you're picking, I think it's actually a really exciting uh, split coming up in Europe to look at the young new talent coming through. Yeah. Again, honorable shout outs to Sheriff and Cadrill on H2K. I think they'll both put up really stellar performances as well. Just not quite as good uh, <laughs> as Upset. Yeah. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more esports content.